this was the scene on the streets of downtown Atlanta earlier today where thousands of people came out to support March for Our Lives, a national movement that focuses on gun reform. We must stop it and we must stop it here and now. A civil rights legend leading the way, supporting younger generations on their fight for gun reform. We're never too young, we're never too old to march, to speak up, to speak out and find a way to get in the way to do something about gun violence. Saturday, thousands packed the streets of downtown Atlanta for the March for Our Lives movement. We need to make our voices heard and we need to show politicians and show the president that we're a generation that is united around this issue. The peaceful march took supporters from the Center for Civil and Human Rights all the way to the state capitol. We're here supporting the kids. They led this movement. They, they organized this march today and everybody here is supporting them. The unified crowd pushing for one thing, changes in legislation to make schools safer. There's no kids should have to should have to suffer and die while they're trying to get an education. We need gun reform. We need gun reform maybe like 2016. Jacob Zaslov survived the massacre at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. He says seeing the tremendous support at Saturday's march has given him hope for future generations. Not only will we solve this issue, but we may even heal this terrible divide in our country. Organizers tell me this is not a one day event. They say they plan on doing everything they can to fight for gun reform. In Atlanta, Natalie Foltz, Fox 5 News.